Okay, so when we talk about the rotator cuff, rotator cuff tears, kind of the, the gradation of tears. So one, we have some maybe just irritation. So the rotator cuff really attached, but it's just irritated. So that's grade one or rotator cuff tendonitis or rotator cuff irritation. The next level would be a partial thickness tear. The low grade partial thickness tear is much more like tendonitis than it is anything else. And so if it's a low grade, less than 50% of the way through, right? So this is 100% and this is 50, so we're less than 50, that's a low grade partial thickness tear, and oftentimes low grade partial thickness tears can heal on their own. And then we go to the next level, which is a high grade partial thickness tear. So a high grade partial thickness tear means we're almost all the way through, or at least more than 50% all the way through, and the difference with that is a high grade partial thickness tear acts a whole lot more like a full thickness rotator cuff. So again, it determines, helps us kind of decide how we treat this. So the last one is a full thickness rotator cuff, which as you can imagine, it's all the way through. So if you have a full thickness rotator cuff tear, that's when we talk about a more emergent or urgent timing of repairing that rotator cuff.